the pocket rocket. We're making rockets using paper matches. Paper matches, aluminum foil, a bent paper clip, safety glasses, a barbecue lighter, and a nearby fire extinguisher are all you need. We experimented with a lot of different folding techniques. What follows is our best method developed during years of R&D. It's hard doing these outside because of the wind. If you launch inside, be very careful. Our furthest launch is over 170 inches, but pocket rockets can go backwards and sideways too. This is about the proper amount of foil. Too much foil and the match will be too heavy and won't go too far. Too little foil and it'll just blow out the side and go nowhere or sideways. Fold along the length of it like a hot dog roll. Place the match in the fold. Use the sewing needle to place in the match and then crimp the tin foil tightly down over the needle. Begin folding around carefully and keep the foil as tight as possible to the match head. Fold around about two to three times, squeezing tightly as you do. Compression is important. Keeping the, the needle in place and after about two thirds or a third of the foil has been wrapped around, begin folding it upwards. This is an example showing the upward style fold. Once you've gone up, then fold over the top of the match. This prevents the flame from escaping straight out ahead and the match going backwards. Here we have it going back down. Notice the sewing needle is still in place. This is about the proper amount of foil. At this point, either cut or tear the excess foil off. Notice that I've used only about half of the original amount of foil. If you can, step on the match head carefully. This increases compression and give you a further launch. Cut about half of the match, the paper part of the match off. Here we have the finished product. Note the removed needle has left an exhaust port for the hot gases to escape backwards. Hold the butane match to the head and wait for the fun after placing the match on a bent paper clip.